Dong Zhi Jie Kuai Le Happy Dong Zhi Festival. It has been a tradition for Chinese family to eat Tang Yuan or sweet glutinous rice bowl, and the complete story is in the description box below. For the ginger sugar syrup, first crush the ginger. I use a stone pestle to do that. Pour the water to the palm sugar, ginger, and pandan leaves, and cook with a low heat until it boils for five minutes. Set it aside to let the flavor infuse to the sugar. For the chewy ball, make a small well and add in the water in four times of addition to the flour. Knead the dough until smooth, and it takes about five minutes. To make different color, divide the dough, and this time I am making five different colors. The red, orange, green, brown, and white color. Put some food colorant on the dough and knead until the color is homogenized. Mix through in the dough and repeat for another color until you get all of the color that you want. In a flat surface or table, spread the clean towel and divide the dough into small pieces before rolling them into a ball. It depends on how big you want your tang yuan or chewy ball, but usually I just make it around like um, half centimeter in diameter or maybe one centimeter, it's around that size. Continue to roll into small balls for every color except the red and brown dough. For the red dough, the black sesame filling is made. Crush 3 tablespoons of black sesame seed, 3 tablespoons of sugar with 1 tablespoon corn or rice syrup. Mix well. Divide the red dough into bigger pieces and flatten the dough like when you want to make a dumpling. Put a teaspoon of the black sesame seed filling in the middle and carefully wrap it and make sure that there is no hole or the black sesame seed will come out when you cook it so just make sure you wrap it and carefully because I know it's difficult Do the same for the brown one, except put a piece of hazelnut chocolate or any kind of filling that you like. Let them to air dry for at least one hour, and to cook the chewy ball, prepare also the cold water. When the water starts to boil, add in the chewy balls and cook until the balls are floating on the surface. Take the balls out and directly immerse them into cold water to stop to stop cooking and create a chewy texture. To serve, take two big spoon of ginger sugar syrup and the chewy balls, and this is the inside of the chocolate balls and the black sesame balls. It's very tasty. The chocolate's still warm, and the black sesame seed is not too sweet, just a balance. And thank you for watching. Hope you can try it. In the next video, I am going to make Christmas cupcake. See ya!